I wanted to make a quick video today to answer the question, what's with that K button? Now this K button will only be visible if you have donated for the software. And I know it's visible in potato and banana versions of voice meter. I can't remember if it's in the base version. You'll have to let me know in the comments below. But what's with that K button is that the K stands for karaoke. And that's why I've got music coming in through this channel and I've got voice communications like Discord coming in through this other channel, just in case I ever want to try to sing along with some music. Now, it's not perfect, okay? It doesn't have AI built in. It doesn't know what kind of music you're playing. It doesn't have all the original tracks before the song was mastered. All it can do is apply some different equalization to the source to do its very best to remove the vocals. So what you're going to want to do is listen to the song, play the song that you're going to want to sing along with, and then select the different modes. There are four different modes. One of them is dash M, one of them is dash one, one of them is dash two, and the other one is this little waveform picture. And as you cycle through those, you will hear the difference in how it is trying to remove or reduce the vocals from that source. Now this final setting, the waveform, uh, I call it that because it looks a little bit like this. If you know anything about EQs from my EQ video, you know that vocals tend to live kind of in the middle of the frequency spectrum. And what this is doing is it's trying to send all of those, everything in the middle, straight down to the floor. Now the problem with that is that it's also going to take down a lot of the music, a lot of the instrumentals behind the vocals. So it's sort of a Hail Mary catch-all. The other ones are going to have varying degrees of success depending on the type of music and the type of vocals that you're working with. But now you know what the K button does. Told you it was going to be a short video. Bye bye